Now, NBC5 First Warning Weather, the area's certified most accurate forecast. All right, 646 on your Wednesday morning and the sunshine returns today. I'm really looking forward to it. It yes. sticks around as well. It's not just a one day thing. We go the rest of the work week with plenty of sun to enjoy. Good. Rain doesn't come back until next week and we're not going to even consider nope. that right now. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Let's enjoy the nice weather while it's here. Plan for today looks like this. We're in the mid to upper 60s this afternoon. Wall to wall sunshine and a breeze out of the north and west about five to 10 miles per hour. Beautiful sunrise has been occurring around the region. Just got this photo from Ed Grant in Saranac Lake. We're looking towards some of the Adirondacks in the distance. Believe that's Whiteface Mountain. And you can see those high wavy clouds providing a nice texture to the sky this morning and a little bit of valley fog as well. You may run into this as you're driving around, not just the Adirondacks, but some of the sheltered valleys in Vermont too. We are done with rain for the rest of the week. You can look forward to more warm, sunny days and cool fall nights through the upcoming weekend. And then the rain chances will begin to go up early next week. Monday looks like our next best chance for widespread rain around the region. Storm Tracker this morning has high pressure in control. No rain to be found across the northeast and a very quiet scan locally too. The skies cleared out fast overnight in northern New York, which is why the temperatures are on the chilly side. We're down to 36 in Saranac Lake now. Had some stubborn clouds overnight though in Vermont, which is why we're starting off in the 40s and 50s. It's still cooler than this time yesterday, about 5 to 10 degrees cooler across Vermont. But in the Adirondacks, a bigger difference, close to 20 degrees cooler in Saranac Lake. So a difference you'll notice as you're stepping out the door. There's the sunshine on Futurecast, couple of passing clouds, again close to 70 in the afternoon. We remain mostly clear overnight. We get down to about the 40s and 30s, and we rinse and repeat for tomorrow. Close to 70 with lots of sun, and once again Friday looking sunny with highs a little bit warmer by then getting to about the mid 70s. Now we've been looking at some data behind the scenes. We've been keeping an eye on a smoke plume to the north and some of the latest model projections are bringing it south towards our region. Now this is elevated several thousand feet in the sky, so no air quality impacts expected, but we're noticing a haziness in the sky throughout Thursday, so it may not be a totally crisp blue look. We put a hazy sky possible into the forecast and we'll have to see if that last into Friday too, but that's just a small wrinkle here. Otherwise beautiful through the rest of the week. Some more clouds over the weekend, but dry until Monday highs pretty close to normal. Back to you. All right.